Worst feedback. Um, There's so many. <laughs> When I let my sister hear um, some of our first recordings, but they were only on my iPhone from band practice, and I told her the idea of what we were trying to do, and she told me that it sounded like people beating on a bunch of pots and pans. When someone gives you criticism, you can either get mad or you can get busy, you know? One negative feedback that I had from the boss one time was that he felt that I overshared um, that I overshared myself and my personal life with corporate clients p prior to the show, and he had no understanding, I feel like, of the fact that that is why I was able to connect with an audience of 500 people in a very personal way was because when I share my personal deets and personal information, lo and behold, the other person often also shares back. So I thought that was a terrible piece of advice. It was just like, oh, okay, cool. <laughs> like there's no emotions to the feedback. And sometimes, you know, that's probably also the great the greatest feedback too because in the moment in which someone's interacting with it, they don't get it. Uh, and that's fine. Like sometimes art isn't supposed to be immediate. Maybe, you know, it's like a little time bomb that goes off like three months later when they see something else and then it complements what you have created and they arrive at a new uh, insight. I have been told by certain people in the arts community that are, are people of color, that because of where I dance and how I present myself, I seem to be shutting out half of myself as if I'm ashamed of it. Helpful, constructive criticism, but definitely not presented in the best way. And I took it very defensively and um, it's stuck with me for almost a decade now. The worst feedback I ever received was somebody saying they just had no idea what they were supposed to get out of the episode they had just watched. It was partly good for me to hear that because I think it's easy to just get feedback from your friends, but it also made me realize like, I have an audience, I have somebody that I, a certain audience I'm making this for. And this individual that I got the feedback from was a white man who is the opposite of my audience. It's always hard to get bad feedback, but you have to take it with a grain of salt.